Right, hi everyone, I'm just waiting in a giant traffic queue, so I'm going to give you a quick little tip uh, in terms of pricing for your photography. Um, most of you will know this already, uh, but this is for people who are maybe just getting into uh, photography or um, or just getting into business. Um, here's, our, here's two things to look up and research and learn about um, in terms of pricing. Um, there's two main ways of getting your clients to either buy into a service or to pay more for a service. Um, and the terms are, the annoying thing is I've forgotten the terms. Uh, the first one is foot in the door, and the other one is door in the face? I, do, I can't, uh, foot in the door, foot in the door, door in the face. I think it's those two. Uh, check those out, uh, research those. What it is, is effectively, uh, foot in the door uh, is effectively you're a, you're a salesperson and you go, hi, I've got this tiny little thing which you might like to buy. And they go, oh, I am interested in that. And they go, oh, and you could also buy X, Y, and Z. Um, so that's foot in the door. Uh, and in terms of photography, uh, business-wise, that can be um, if somebody says, how much for a wedding, um, how, how much is your, your wedding photography? Your foot in the door pricing could be Prices start at £300. So everyone thinks, oh, £300, cool. And then they're on your website, they're looking through, and once they're on the website, you've got a bit of engagement, and then that's when people suddenly realise, like, oh, £300, that's for turning up and taking a couple of photos. Oh, so the, the, the silver package is, uh, so that's the bronze package, the silver package, £500. Okay, that's taking it from uh, the ceremony to the, the dance. Okay, and then there's the gold package, which is so on and so forth. So that's the foot in the door concept in terms of uh, price structuring and how to uh, develop your pricing in your business. The other one, I may be wrong on this, uh, I think it's called door in the face. Um, do it probably isn't. But that's where you kind of go along and you give an outlandish price and people are just like, whoa, no, didn't think that. And then you scale back and then they go, oh, that's a bargain. So again, if uh, somebody says, how much for a wedding photography? You go, two and a half thousand pounds. And they go, oh, right. And you go, oh, but is yours in the UK and within the same city as mine? Oh, okay, that, that's already saving me a thousand pounds. Oh, is it just for an evening session? Right, okay, it's down to 500 pounds. So suddenly people's expectations go from, oh my God, to, oh, right, now I know where the price levels are. So it, it's developing your customers uh, understanding and expectations of uh, the costs uh, involved. So a lot of people will go, oh yeah, wedding photography, £300, yeah, that's about right. It's like, no, that's pretty much how much it costs just to turn up and have the insurance and rent the gear. Um, and at the same time, if you say £3,000, people go, oh my God, that's ridiculous. But then that means your customers are like, oh, now I realise it's quite an expensive thing, but I can get it for half the price of £1,500, Oh, happy days. Um, you'll see that in many things uh, all around the place, but in, in photography, it's you, you look on commercial photographer websites uh, and you'll see a lot of things. Or, or sometimes in their written advertisements, it's usually foot in the door uh, stuff. So that gets people to their website um, to look at their, their stuff. Um, but at the same time, I suppose door in the face could actually work as well. Everyone goes, this guy's charging three grand for a wedding? Whoa, I want to see his stuff. And then they go on it and they go, oh, that's for if you're traveling to America and you need insurance and all that kind of stuff. So fair enough. So yeah, my little tips there, just uh, check that out. But not just wedding photography, all types of photography that you do. So give that a check and see how you can adapt that to your business. Cheers, bye-bye.